Oh, hello there. My name's Art. I'm very skilled with the knowledge about these areas of Fera. I have lived long enough to know my fair share of this land's history. Come, let me teach you about the crystals, which powers this land and gives us leaders. Crystals give the animals their powers. Only some are born with crystals, however. Animals, like snakes and kobolds, for example, do not have any crystals. But there is at least one animal from each tribe that is born with a crystal to protect their kind. But for now, let me tell you about the crystals. One of the least powerful crystals is the water crystal. It is blue, and mainly kitsunes are born with them. Water crystals allow the owner to control any type of water, as well as create it out of thin air, though they cannot create mass amounts of water. It is still a good crystal. Another crystal is the wind crystal, which is common in griffins and many animals with wings. The wind crystal is a green crystal that allows the owner to control wind in their favor. Most griffins in the Sky Kingdom have these crystals. Next up is the fire crystal. Many Senris are born with these, and the crystal gives them the ability to control fire. It is a very dangerous crystal if it ends up in the wrong hands, because mass amounts of fire can be created. It's good to have a water element nearby potentially evil fire crystal owners for their safety. Now, of course, there are tons of crystals, too many to name, but the most powerful crystal in existence is the purple crystal. Only a few animals have ever had one because it contains mass amounts of power and is very rare. It mainly happens in a few dragons, but only four known dragons have had this at some point in time. Now, for those of us who don't have crystals, there is another way to get them. To get a crystal from another person, one must either take the crystal out of their head somehow, either in combat or them surrendering it, and place it in their own heads. If you wish to keep the past crystal holder alive, you can easily replace their crystal with another one. If they do not receive a new crystal within the next hour, they will die. I myself know a lot about crystals due to the fact that I used to make them to corrupt people. But that's a story for another day, of course. I hope you enjoyed this little history lesson. I myself know a lot about crystals due to the fact that I used to make them to corrupt people. But that's a story for another day, of course. I hope you enjoyed this little history lesson. You may need this understanding if you too wish to become a crystal holder. Farewell.